everyone, my name is Rebecca Grace from Rebecca Grace Designs, and I am the creator of the Encyclopedia of Code, which provides hundreds of copy and paste code snippets for Squarespace designers to use on their clients' websites. Today, we're going to talk about how to rotate the shape block inside of Squarespace. So in this section here, I'm using 7.1 and Fluid Engine. I've added a image block and some text, and I've also added this shape block behind the text. Um, now to change which one's in front, you're going to use these buttons up here. And so I've just placed the shape block behind the image block. But to make it just a little bit more unique, I want to rotate that shape just slightly um, to help look, make it look a little bit more custom. So to do that, I'm going to go to Design, Custom CSS, and I need to find the block ID of this shape block. So I'm going to hover over top the shape block, right click and select Inspect. And you'll notice when I hover over this, the shape block is highlighted. So I know I have the right element inside of here. If I don't, if the image block was highlighted, for example, when I hover over top, the image block is selected. And so I'm gonna keep kind of moving up and down my HTML in here until I find the point where my shape block is being highlighted. Once I have the right spot, I'm going up until I find a line that has ID equals block dash YUI. So make sure it has this block in front. If it doesn't, it's not the right ID. So I want it to have the block in front. And when I am hovering over top, I want my shape block to be selected. That's how I know it's the right ID. So I'm gonna copy that ID and inside of my custom CSS box, I'm gonna put slash star space star slash and that's just gonna help me put a comment or a note for myself and I'm going to put um, rotate shape block on homepage in this case so that I can later on know exactly what this code was for. I'm going to put a hashtag and paste in my block ID, an open and closing curly bracket, and inside of that, my code for rotating is transform colon rotate bracket, and then you can use any sort of degree. So I can say 10 degrees and then I'm closing it off with a semicolon. Now, if I wanna rotate my shape the other direction, I can put a negative instead, and it will rotate that way. And you can use any positive or negative number um, up to 360 degrees. And then I can keep playing with this until it's how I want it. I can go into the edit and move it around, but I like how this looks. So I'm going to click save, and that's it. That is how you rotate a shape inside of Squarespace 7.1. If you like this tutorial, make sure you like and subscribe to my YouTube channel or sign up for the freebie in my footer on my blog so that you can be notified when another tutorial is posted.